WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Wednesday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell. We already got some action across the board. Retail sales out this morning, a half hour ago. That number minus 0.3% for the month of September. That's opposed to an estimate of an increase of about 0.2 to 0.3. We'll jump over in a moment, but that hit in some of the markets, especially gold getting a pop. Dow futures right now, negative 52 points, trading 26,950. You get the S&P futures, negative by about seven, trading at 2,990. NASDAQ futures negative by 24 points, trading at 79.35. Ten-year yield right now sitting at 1.74%. Start things off this morning. Let's take a look at the VIX. Volatility index getting a little bit of a negative action in the market. That results usually in a higher VIX, but all relative 13.85. Very little volatility premium priced into this market. Start things off. Let's jump over to it. And we're going to start it off with the news because it's hitting some of the markets, as I said. There's your headline. Line, retail sales unexpectedly decline and a sign consumer economy could be cracking. So headline number, retail sales dropping 0.3% last month as households cut back spending on motor vehicles, building materials, hobbies, and online purchases. The big surprise, it was supposed to be a 0.3% climb. Compared to September last year, retail sales increased 4.1%. With that in mind, Let's jump to the markets. We'll start it off with the Dow. You can kind of see the 830 volatility. There's 825 coming into that number. Not too dramatic. Wait till we get to the gold chart. You'll really see the acceleration. Dow 30 trading 26,963. NASDAQ 100 trading 79.38 right now. S&P 500 trading at 29.92. About a half hour ago, we we're up there at 29.96. There's your crude oil market, under $53, trading at $52.79. And there's your gold contract. How about that spot pop? How about that pop? On the retail sales, you got gold trading from $1,482, now making a run for $1,500. You got gold trading at $1,494, and the euro US dollar trading at $1,1040. In terms of what else you have happening, Big day of earnings yesterday for banks, and it continues today with Bank of America shares rising as they post better than expected profit. We'll jump over to that chart quickly. BAC, Bank of America, looking to open at about 3036, closed at 2973. And this afternoon, Netflix out with their earnings. We'll see how they do currently trading 283. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesamento right now. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Have a great Wednesday.